Now, what is our purpose in life when we have a goal that we want to achieve, but we're too afraid to achieve it, so we give it up? What's up? It's your boy, Simba the Prince, and welcome to the jungle. Now, ladies and gentlemen, you have to ask yourself just one question. Are we really living, or are we just trying to survive each and every day? See, there's a big difference between living and just trying to survive, and it's just one word that just comes in between those two to separate them. And that's your dreams. See, why do we give up our dreams and just settle in? Why? See, as children, as little kids we were, we always had a dream. We had a dream to become maybe a doctor, a police officer, a singer, actor, actress, anything. But then as we get older, we give up our dreams. Then when you see that actor or actress or singer that's actually making and doing what they love to do, and now you're jealous and then you kind of wonder in your mind, that could have been me. But yet you fail to realize that they didn't give up on their dreams. They fought each and every day. Because the dreams that they had as they were kids, they stuck with it. See, although times got rough for them, and I'm sure it did, they fought for their dreams. They fought. They protected. See, a dream is more than something that's been given to you by life when you're born. A dream is something that's been given to you by life when you're born, but it's also meant for you to protect it as you get older. See, when we were born, we were all blessed with the dream. We all had that blessing. And you can't say that you didn't have it. You can't tell me that when you were young, you didn't want to become something when you got older. So we all had that dream. But you see, life is a test. And one of the tests that we get in life is the dreams that's been given to us. The test is how bad and how hard and how long will we fight to protect our dream. Let me tell you something. The day that you give up on your dreams will be the day that your purpose of living just stops. The rest of the pages that's going to be in that book of yours is not going to be written anymore. It's done. Somebody's going to hand you a new book, but you see, it won't be blank. It'll already be filled out. It'll already be written out for you, waiting for you to follow the instructions of it, waiting for you to go by the guidelines of it. And what do we call that book? Structured Society. And in that book, they will show you a different path. They will teach you how to walk that alternative path. And that path is what? The trying to survive path. And in that path, they will show you what you should do, how you should do it, and when you should do it. And I know you will not like it. I know there's many of you that's already been learning that path, right? There's already many of you that's been walking that path, huh? Those who don't like their jobs, those who hate their coworkers, who hate getting up the next day to go to work, and they don't like what they're doing. But you see, you can always free your mind. You can always free your mind. All you have to do is take your dream back. That's it. Take it back and protect it this time. Fight for it this time. You get your life back. Your life. Not the way they want you to live your life, but your life. The way you want to live it. The way you want to see your life going. How you want to be happy. It's your book. Write your story. Don't let them give you a book that's already been written for you to follow. Listen to me. and Listen to me carefully. Listen to me. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid to do what you want to do. Don't be afraid to go do what makes you happy. Don't, don't apologize for it. You don't owe nobody any explanations. You don't owe anybody any apologies. The only person that you owe an apology to is yourself. You owe yourself an apology for giving up. So please, pick yourself back up and continue to fight. We're here living on this earth for temporary reasons. Who knows what comes up after us? We owe it to ourselves to fully commit our lives to being happy. But the only thing that we need to do each and every day is to fight for our happiness. That's it. Protect your dream. And what are we fighting and protecting our dreams from? Structured society. See, many of us don't even realize that structured society has persuaded us to give up our dreams as we get older. It's like signing a deal with the devil. You're no longer happy. So please, have that jungle mentality. And hunt. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, that is a wrap of this video topic, and I hope you found that video very inspirational and motivational. And if you like that video, just hit the like button. And hey, if you have a video topic that you want me to do, just comment down below, let me know. Also, share this video to pass on the motivation. Also, don't forget to check out my last video right there, which was Battle of the Sexes, Women's Secrets, featuring Soleil 88, a collaboration video, so you really don't want to miss that one. Also, don't forget to hit that yellow subscribe button right there in that corner. Why? Because I make videos every Monday and Wednesday, so you might want to tune in to check that out. So stay tuned. So without further ado, my friends, till we meet again, I can't wait to see you again. Be you, be happy, be beautiful. Some of the prince gone. Adrian, I did it. Thank you.